Hi everyone, it's Carly with Laughing Daisy Co. Today I'm gonna to go ahead and show you how to do a double crochet. So let's get started. First off, I've got my nice chain here. I've just done 10 chains just to kind of give you an idea of how to do this stitch. So with a double crochet, first you're gonna go ahead and get your yarn ready. I like to go over the pinky, under the index, just like that, and there we go. Okay, and then um, we've got the 10, but now how you're going to go ahead and start is with a double crochet, I like to go ahead and do two and three. So remember the half double crochet, we did two up. With a double crochet, I like to do three chains up to raise it up to where my stitch is going to be. Okay, so for the double crochet, what you'll do is you're going to yarn over and you'll go into the fourth one from the hook. So we've got one, two, three, four, let's see. We've got one, two, three, four. So we're going to yarn over, hold that yarn over with that index finger on your right hand. That kind of helps you to make sure that's not gonna go anywhere. Then you'll go in and you're going through the back loop. And then we're gonna go ahead and we'll yarn over and pull it through. And we've got three loops here. You're gonna yarn over and pull it through the first two. Now you have two more. Yarn over and pull it through those last two. All right, so we'll yarn over, do the next one. We're gonna go into the next stitch right there, into the back loop, and we'll yarn over. We've got three loops. Yarn over through two, yarn over and pull through the last two. All right, I'm gonna keep going. I'm gonna go a little slower so you can just see that. So we yarned over into the stitch, yarn over and pull it through. We've got one, two, three, and then we'll yarn over, pull through two, yarn over, pull through two. All right, so um, this is a really nice building stitch. This stitch is used a lot in granny squares and it's a really popular stitch. Um, I really like to use it for a lot of different things. And um, I know it's a favorite of a lot of people. So, okay, so we'll keep going. So we'll yarn over in, and we're just gonna go to the end of the row so you can see how to, how to turn around. Three, pull through two, and pull through two. Yarn over into the stitch, back loop. Yarn over, pull through. Yarn over, pull through. Yarn over and pull through those last two. All right, so it looks like I've got one last one. So I'm gonna go ahead and go in. I've got my three loops. Yarn over, pull through two. Yarn over, pull through two. Now I'm gonna go ahead and chain three. One, two, and three. Then I turn it around. And I'm gonna go ahead and yarn over. Go into the fourth one. One, two, three, four. From my hook. And now I've got my three loops. And you would just continue on. So we would yarn over, pull that through for the three, yarn over, pull through two, and yarn over, pull through the last two. I'm gonna go ahead and undo this, so I'm not going to keep going, um, but you kind of get the idea. So what questions do you have? Go ahead and let me know in the comments.